Hello everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Ikaiz, welcome back to Frost. Um, this is a survival card game. I, I hope that you guys saw the previous episode with the introduction where I also beat the tutorial. Which in and of itself, I mean, it's not the easiest thing to do. I don't want to brag a lot, but you know, it's... Uh, yeah, congrats me, right? Yeah, alright, alright. Okay, okay, calm down, okay. So we're actually going to do an actual run now. We're going to go to classic mode and we're going to try medium difficulty. Which, to if you guys purchase a game, it's not going to be available to you because you actually have to beat the game, which I did on easy mode. And then you get access to medium. But I am going to go straight for medium. Which is actually not a good idea because it's going to omit some information that you guys could use. I think you guys should see the way that easy is, and then I think it would be a good idea to go to medium, otherwise you're going to be confused. So let's go to easy, actually. The frost is walking, always leaving stone and dust behind. So we too walk amongst the stone and the dust. And we survive. We have our ways, taught by the story stones carved by our fathers and grandfathers. I've been walking my whole life, and if the spirits of the great wind allow me, I'll be able to reach the refuge, the one place where the forest of the frost never goes. This is my story, may it be carved on a story stone and passed upon my sons, my grandsons, and whoever will, will have enough time to read my story. Alright, so this is going to be our starting deck. It looks like a very average and easy kind of deck to work with. We have, we're going to start with a total of 10 cards in our entire deck. Um, it's going to be a chill run. <laughs> we're going to have so many frost puns. <laughs> it's going to be cool. <laughs> in fact, so cool, some people might get frostbites. So, four survivors. We get two food cards and we get two material cards and... As always, two fatigue cards. So, we don't have a choice but to say, okay. This is me. This is my dumb face and my dumb life. And we are we are eight steps ahead of the frost, basically. Maximum. So, you can actually kind of, you know, try to str strategize and end turns instead of traveling. Even if you have the option of traveling. Just so you could use your frost counter to go down and go back up again otherwise you know traveling at max does not give you more time and you'll see what i mean when it's in action so already we have two idea cards we've traveled to a new region it's the snowy tundra um this region is going to need three food no material one survivor and in our deck we have four survivors that you saw two fatigue cards two materials two food we need more food than our deck can ever provide, which means we definitely need to send somebody out uh, to scavenge for food. But before I do that, let's see if there's anything here that's very important, including, you know, Singer. Singer, if I give a food and a survivor, there's a 75% chance of finding another survivor. If I give away a food or straight up getting a survivor, why would I? Why would I do this? Why? Oh, because it could be multiple survivors. A Seventy-five percent chance of getting multiple ones. Why would I spend more food to activate when I can just use a top half? I'm a little confused about that card, but you know, if you haven't, if you know how what, what this is trying to say, is there? Hold on, I th there's there's a legend here. Question mark. Get a chance to add X resource cards of the in indicated type. Add X. Oh, this is chance. Why would I? Okay, so that's that that then really doesn't make any sense to me because why give away food? Oh, because this won't get a. Oh, I think I understand it now. 
Because once this is in my hand, if I activate the bottom of it by dragging a food over it, there's a 75% chance that I can get a survivor. But this card will stay in my hand. If I if I do if I click the top of it, it'll be spent, and I will get the survivor. And I think I think that's it. I'm now about 100% sure. <laughs> We're definitely gonna take the spear. We're not gonna leave that behind. We're going to send a uh, survivor for the regional re requirements. We're gonna send both of these guys to search for food. One of them came back with just fatigue. That's okay. And a turn, what do we get? Um, food. Food to draw a card. No. Survivor to find food. We found fatigue. So now we have two extra fatigue cards in my deck. And all of our food cards are, you know, lent to the regional requirements. So it's going to be important to get this extractor, actually. Because by spending two wood... I can add this card to my hand, and what this card can do is 50% chance of creating food, or I can feed it wood and get food, or feed it material and get food. Um, since we're about to move on, and we should, we've already lost an extra turn more than I like it, we're gonna, we're gonna risk the 50%. Alright, we got the food. It's added. This is added to my deck permanently. I have an extra food card, and you can see here. And I'm going to use that for the requirement. We're going to travel. All these food cards are going to come back to me. And also the uh, survivors that were away. But it's always, always, always a good idea to send your survivor to, you know, once you're done and you're about to travel and there's nothing else you can do, send your survivor to whichever remaining survivors you have to come back with resources there's a chance they can come back with fatigue or they might die but it's better to send them for either you know extra food or extra material or extra survivors now we can travel and we're back up to seven and if i'm smart enough and travel on time i can go back to back up to eight now a viewpoint is an event where if I spend one wood, this is the icon that I want to explain to you guys. If I spend one wood, or remove one one wood, I'm going to have exploration times two, meaning you can choose the next uh, card of the region or event deck and remove the others to kind of, you know, choose your own destiny kind of path kind of thing. We're going to use this, uh, two survivors for the wet tundra. We're going to end a turn. Sadly, we don't we don't have the means to make more food. End. And that was the end of my deck. Therefore, all the discarded cards were reshuffled back into my deck. I get my two cards, uh, my two food right away. Um, there is a pickaxe here. Pickaxe is great. You can use a survivor to make food. But I don't, I don't have any wood. I don't even think I have wood in my entire deck. Scary. I don't even want to think about that. Alright, let's travel. I really like these footsteps in the snow. I think we can burn our food for the supply goodies bag. And test our luck with some wood food perfect perfect put this in here as well um oh this cleaver is also very good but I'm, i have to give away my only material card in my own entire deck but check this out by if i give this away i can have this and then not only is a weapon I can burn it, I can either burn this card to use it as a weapon, one time weapon, or one time two wood added to my deck, or 25% chance of actually finding wood without losing it. So I'm going to take my chance. I couldn't find it, but I didn't lose it. It went into my discard pile. It didn't, it didn't, you know, get burned. Um, I have enough survivors, I don't need to burn food for getting a survivor. I will send my survivors out for more people. 
uh, fatigue. That sucks. I will take my chance at making more food. I couldn't, so we're gonna travel. What do we have here? We have fire, we have supplies. Um, uh, I'll take the supplies. Because I have so much food. I created so much food! Alright, there we go. Some wood. We get, I get two extra fatigue cards. This is awful. Um, I need to rest. If, if I get another hand with two or three of these fatigue cards, I need to rest. Put this guy in here. Um, I think I might take this fire card, use the drawing effect. Oh, man. And, alright, this is a good time to rest. I gotta get rid of two. Um, and you can't use any cards and rest. You can, you can, if you want to rest, it can be only, that can be the only action you take during that turn. Alright, um, I'm gonna send more people out to find wood because this story stone, well, if I use it, it will get rid of a fatigue card in my hand and that's priceless that is awesome um two food just to make sure that we fulfill the requirement for that let's send out a survivor to scavenge perfect we get we'll take that let's send another one out we get another survivor let's send, send hair out we get a fatigue card totally fine we'll travel back up to seven you know we're still surviving here things are not that horrifying i mean things are bad but not terrible this is a priest, so the priest, I can give him either, um, I don't know what this is, it's, it's one of those special items, which I will show you what, what they are eventually, uh, or food, and he will heal me for however much it says, so this guy for one, and, you know what, obviously we don't need it, why, why even think about it, whatever. We're going to use a story stone to do exactly what it's meant to do. We're going to take it, burn our fatigue card, um, give the food for... Ooh, plant pot is so good. I can afford wasting a little more time to get the plant pot. That'll always make me food. Alright, let's put the food in there. Send the survivor out. Oh my god, stop getting fatigued! What's wrong with you? I... I... Shit, I totally should have rested. I was not paying attention. Alright, let's put that in. Um, cannibalism is like last resort kind of idea card. I'm not gonna take this idea. Not a bright idea. At all. We will send out this survivor. Scavenge perfect. Goes in there. And... Um, it's a good time to rest. We're ticking down fast. Stay 13. I'm this is I'm taking a huge risk by doing what I'm doing, but I think it's gonna be worth it in the end. Let's take this. We'll always have this, and it will always make us a food like that. It'll always add to my entire deck permanently. Um, excuse one. Expedition. It's okay. We'll come across another one of them. 25% chance of finding wood. Let's do that. Perfect. Put that in there. We did it. We can move on. Back up to five. It's pretty, pretty tight. Pretty tight. Let's get back up to like six or seven. That's where I'm. That's where I feel the most comfortable. We're in the taiga. We are advancing quickly rather. Uh, we're very short on wood and material. We have a decent number of survivors but so much fatigue as well. Uh, right now I can give a survivor to make some wood and I might. Right now we're gonna give these guys for the regional requirements first and foremost. We will take our 50% chance to create food and no luck. We're going to end a turn. New cards. Uh, 
looks like a really decent chance to rest. Get rid of uh, all those fatigue cards, but get one step closer to death. But hopefully we're gonna manage it. This is not going to remove my material card. This is only going to borrow it. So I'm going to draw three more cards. Use two food. We gotta, we gotta move on. We cannot end turn. If I go down to two, no way. No, 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 Find food. Oh my god. Oh, this is terrible. Give me this. Let's burn this fatigue card. Let's keep that down. Oh, so close to death. Okay, make food. Use food. Send survivor out. Make food. Nothing. What? <laughs> That sucks. Alright, we're traveling on. Okay, back up to three. This is not, not great. It's not great. It's not looking that great. What do we need? We need still need wood. This is like beginning. This is my deck. My entire deck. I don't have anything in this card pile. My entire deck has one material card in it. Yikes. Alright, first things first. Kill the wolf. Um, make food. Oh! All right, give this wood to get this. Now watch. Since we have another one in my deck and we don't have an enemy sitting here, I'm going to use it to get two wood. Boom! Two for one-ing, baby. That's what, I'm, that's what I'm talking about. Um, And then... Bloop. And turn. Oh, God. Down to two again. Yikes. Um, please make me, make me a piece of material. Nothing! One over here. I need one food. Oh, the RNGs is, man. The love. The RNGs is love. Okay, 13, this, 13 more regions to go. It's a long, it's a long distance to travel, okay? Don't underestimate it. It takes a long, long time. I'm producing, I got, you know, I got the, the food plant, or the, the plant pot. It's making me food. The one thing I'm nev never gonna run out, I think, is food cards. Uh, in fact... In fact... Let's do this. Give two food. And... Lend the survivor. We're not gonna lose the survivor. We lost the two food, but we're not gonna lose the survivor. Burn this expedition card to get us the three wood. Use the three wood for our regional requirements. Uh, might as well draw my card. Um, actually, might as well use my, you know, burn my two food. Uh, in hopes of getting two food and something good back. I get one food, two survivors, which is great. It's awesome. And one fatigue card. It's totally manageable. I don't need to worry about it. We're going to send out survivors. Find food. Perfect. You guys are you guys are rocking it. You guys are pretty good. Pretty oh my god. So many people here. Travel. So many people here. We made so many new friends. Um I don't need another fire card. Uh, I actually, let's go straight into fulfilling things. And I need a weapon. Man, this is this is not looking great. Um, you go here. Let's draw three cards. Since I can't fulfill this right now anyway. Because if I put this in here, I'm only going to have a survivor to find either food or wood at a low chance. So I need to use this wood to draw more cards. Which is actually not that bad. Use this piece of wood here. Uh, 
send a survivor out for... Oof, lucky. Oh man, if I find another material from this... Oh, oh I was going to say, I'll be too lucky. Alright, end of turn, down to three. It's getting a little uh, scary. It's a tiny bit scary. Oh, we get this now. Which we unlocked this card last time. Um, yes. And sure, I'll take this card. Burn my guy. Burn my food. And send my survivors out. Please don't give me any more fatigue cards. Oh, man, look at this. Do you know what the heck is happening? All right. One food for a chance at three times 50% chance of making materials. Surprise me. What? Oh. Bogus. Travel. I mean, I have more than enough survivors to uh, sacrifice for the wolf. Take that. Enjoy it. Oh my god. Cannibals? I had never seen. Oh, this is the one that we uh, also unlocked last time. Uh, a menace to defeat. Cannibals. We need two spears to kill the cannibals or two food. Otherwise, they attack us for one when I travel. If this card is undefeated, this will apply after you travel. All right. Um, I can do the two food, no problem. No problemo, senor. Okay. I think I want this. And I think I'm going to do what I think is the right thing to do. And take it right now. Give it to me. Thank you. Use this. Um, put one food in here. I'm not traveling yet. Uh, but I will give you one food. And then end the turn. Okay. Two wood. Oh no. What am I going to do about this food? Alright, you guys have to find food. Go out. Find me food. Find an apple. Yes, an apple! Here, cannibals. Cannibals, you need an apple. And there will be no more cannibalism. Can and, and, and cannibalism was no more. Let's move on. Travel. Yes. Yes. This is hope. This is love. This is knowing that I can see my children again one more time. Wait, what, what are the options here? So we have tool makers. Give away your food. Make one material card. Singer is tempting. Pot plant. Or pot plant. I don't, I don't want a pot plant. That is... Kids, you don't want a pot plant. You need a plant pot. Um... A lot of survivors needed here. We're never going to be able to do this. Uh, so what we're going to do is we will... We will rock you. I have enough food and all to get this idea card. Let's do it. Bye, survivor forever. Bye, food forever. Hello, new survivor. And... Hello, food. Please give me food. Hello, food! Yes, yes. And turn down to three. Ooh, fatigue. Fatigue! I don't like fatigue cards. But we gotta move on. We gotta keep going. Uh, food for wood. No. Let's go. Actually, I think for once we have more wood than we have food. Um. We could get more wood. Or I can get, you know, try for more 
food, wood, and like all assortment of things over here. Uh, or, or. Or, eh. This, this is a, I, 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 you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. Oh, no, that car died. Jeez. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna move on. We're gonna, we're gonna have a, a survivor sacrificed. Boom. Shakalaka. Uh... This would have been perfect for rest. It is still perfect for rest. Rest. Okay. We have two fire cards, one pickaxe card. I don't think we're gonna use a pickaxe. Maybe. It's tempting. We also have the story stone where if you get a f give a food or a wood, we get rid of one fatigue, but we don't need that anymore necessarily. Um, I think it's wise to... Um, send this guy to just find more food. Oh, you know what? Now I have a better idea. Better idea. Let's get that pickaxe. And then let's send this guy to for sure find me food using the pickaxe. There we go. Give the food in. Um, let's, let's use the fire to find another piece of material in my deck. Um... And we're getting really close. Under ten regions left, which is pretty good. Pretty good. It's really good. Plant pot, make free food. Uh, obviously, give this food in here. But first, let's send people out. Okay, okay. I I like this. Burn a wood. Burn another wood, draw three cards. Um, send you out. Oh my god, more. So you scavenge for more wood? Alright, we're gonna take this other fire card, draw more, three more. Oh, this is like an endless cycle now. Okay, send you guys out again. Find me more food, please. There we go. Okay. Um, I think... I think... Let's actually use a supplies bag. Right? Let's do this. Let's get four new cards. One is fatigue. Totally fine. I don't even care. Um, send you guys out. Oh, one of you died. Well, that's, that's not good. That's not good at all. You brought more wood. We'll permanently use one of these woods to get rid of the fatigue card in my hand using the event. The story stone. And then we're gonna use the two food here, obviously. This is one of my smartest turns ever. And then use another piece of material for the three. Send you out again for another food. It almost worked out. <laughs> it almost, almost worked out. And that. All right, man. This is this is really scary. I'm, I've come such a far way, such a long way to to lose this if it happens. Maybe we. I mean, there's a chance. Let's see. Let's just do this again. Keep my fatigue under control. And... Oh, man. I'm good. Everything's fine. Let's just see if we can make another food. We couldn't. Let's travel out. Alright. 32 turns. Day 32. 
Obviously, we're gonna use the plant pot. Make our food. We have a good supply here. <sighs> Alright. Um... 50% chance to make another food. Fails! Uh, food and a dude for explorer. Nah, I don't... What is this ability called? Exploration? Nah, I don't care about that right now. Uh, but I, what I want to do is draw another card. Send you out for the wood. No, actually, I can, I can give you away for the food. But is that necessary? Is that going to be actually necessary? It could be. Let's let's do this. And then let's do this. Pop this. Do this. Let's get ourselves ahead a little bit. And send you out. Or do I need to send you out? I don't need to send you out. I can sacrifice you, actually. But that would be mean. Let's just send you out. Send you out, too. Alright, perfect. Travel, yay! Okay, I'm, I feel pretty good about this right now. Uh, but then again, we're doing this on easy. Like I said before. Easy is actually, in my opinion, now that I've gone through it one time, I can handle it. Ish. Um, uh, nope, not interested in that, not interested in this, not interested in that. Just want to move on, just want to keep going. So what I'm going to do is... Um, give away your food to see if I can find a survivor. Wait, oh, oh, now I understand those cards. So you can either use this guy, the singer, you can either use him as a person or use him as an ability to find a person. So I can either use him to, like, scavenge or drag him over here or I can then use him to find another person, which I did. Great, okay. <coughs> so we're gonna do... So he's like a double... Survivor slash utility card. It's like a two-sided card. All right, so let's put you. Where do I want you? I want you here. And turn. This is pretty good. So see, I can either drag him to like scavenge or to regional requirements, or I can put a food on him and find another person. Um, I'll um. Since he has utility, I don't want him to die. So if I'm ever going to send anybody out to scavenge, it's going to be one of these other guys. Um, I think at this point, cannibalism is not really necessary either as an option to consider. I think right now we're sitting pretty comfortably. We're pretty safe. So what I'm just going to do is uh, put this guy here. Send all these guys out for food. Uh, food? Um, we're gonna have to spend one more turn. I could have done cannibalism for one turn, but is it worth it? Probably not. I'll take this though. And I'll do this. Events. Oh man, choose the next event. Wolf. <laughs> do you want wolf or wolf? I'll take wolf. There you go. Take the wolf. Um, three cards. Three cards. Make my food. Make another food. Um, Get rid of my fatigue in my hand. I mean, why not, right? Why not? Down to one fatigue in my entire deck. Uh, send you to get the cannibalism card before it's too late. I want to have it. You know what this game reminds me of? This game actually reminds me of um, of a Tharsis. Do you guys remember Tharsis? It was this uh, space exploration kind of random number generated kind of, you know, what do you, how would you say, like chance? Puzzle, 
dice game. Anyway. Yeah, this kind of reminds me of that. Like, it has, like, that sort of vibe of how you want to distribute your number of points and how they, like, are restored at the beginning of the next turn. We're, we're good to go. We're good to travel on. Five more regions to go. Three turns before the frost catches up to me. We're doing pretty alright. We need a survivor to get out of this region. We don't have one in my hand right now. We might have to take another knight here. And I don't want to spend another night in these uh, scary, scary regions. Um, cleaver? Yeah, come here. And I'll uh, burn the cleaver for two wood. And I will use one to make one food. Fulfill this. We'll use this to kill the wolf. And we spend the night. Alright, we're getting into danger territory now. Let's put you, obviously, for the regional requirements. And... Let's draw three cards, see what we get. We get one of our fatigue cards. I can just use this to get rid of the rid of this last fatigue in my entire deck. I, I had never had a run with zero fatigue in it. This is fantastic! This is great. Send you out, buddy. No! Alright. <laughs> that was... that sucked. After everything we celebrated, that guy just died. Alright, we can get a food... we can give a food for a draw, which... Out of the 14 food cards in my deck... I th remaining food, by the way. I think it's a great idea to do that. Because we're gonna need a survivor. We're gonna need more survivors for scavenging for the second piece of wood. I don't want to spend too much time in this region. I want to make sure I get out of here. So let's give this. Let's do... This. Uh, interesting. Let's keep doing that. There we go. Uh, you go in here. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. I need you to find wood. Oh, what a perfect round. Travel on. Three regions to go. Cannibals again. Alright. Um, one survivor. Get the three cards. Um, I can use this to actually kill the cannibals outright and draw three more cards definitely gonna be one more food in it perfect give these and I think I'm good I can actually use a torch to explore the places it's going to be the island let's travel on and here we looks like uh, we might we might struggle a little bit so I'm going to use the singer as the dude right yeah let's use a singer as a dude for the pile let's use the wood to get the cleaver let's use the cleaver to kill the wolf Let's, oh, this is going to break my heart. Should I even do this? No. I mean, if I if I sacrifice him, I can get two food. But it's not going to, like, finish this. So what's the point? Let's just end the turn. Did you see this? We, we crawled up back up to five from two or one, whatever it was, two. Um... <laughs> Yeah, it was two. We've never been at one yet. One gets really scary. You get all these lines, like frostbite, like you're about to crystallize on screen. It's, it's pretty scary. Plant pot is going to make us one more food. Extractor might make me more food, if I'm lucky. Nothing. Alright. Uh, you know, nothing is fine too. Can you find me another food? You couldn't. You... Useless poo poo. This, nah, I'm just, just kidding. Just kidding. Put those in. Put this in. Um, pickaxe is also nice. Uh, don't underestimate this. This is uh, not necessarily like the safest of 
situations. If I was at like four or five, maybe. But there's a chance that I could still die. Because I might have like two or three consecutive turns where I don't get all the necessary materials that I need to fulfill the regional uh, requirements. And, I'm and, and you can safely assume that when you go into higher difficulty levels, it's going to require a lot more than just one and four and two and threes and things like that. It's going to be pretty hefty. Pretty darn hefty. Okay, so done with this stuff. Let's try our chance at making free food. Nothing. That's fine. Let's take the pickaxe. Let's try again for free food. Nothing. Survivor, can you go out? Oh, no. Oh, man. I'm sorry, lady. I I mean, you're not you're not alive anymore to hear that I'm sorry. Okay, I think we got this. I think we are totally safe. Totally to ta lay out. And and um why not? And 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 put you here. And travel! Yay! We beat it. We beat an actual campaign run. So congratulations, us. We get Trader, we get Picker, and we get Survivalist. Uh, in the Survivalist, we either have to use a weapon or have to give away food. Otherwise... Uh, you know, we're not going to survive. It's like the game, name of the game is surviving. And for the trader, we can give a person a food and it can be either be a trader person. Uh, same thing as the picker. All these all these people, uh, they require food and a person. I guess it's like a training. You lose a survivor, you gain a survivor with a perk. So this guy becomes able to act as a person or also be fed to make materials, exchange that, or this guy can uh, take one food for the chance of growing more and picking more for you, finding, you know, three times 50% food. Pretty good stuff, pretty awesome, really happy. I can't wait to see all the cards, like, the more you play, the more uh, exciting everything gets because the more possibilities you unlock, the more cards you unlock, and the more scenarios you unlock, and and next time, I think I want to show you this leader scenario, because I think it's really cool. And then we'll also jump into a medium run and see how that is. And I think there might be two more difficulties of, uh, depend. I mean, I'm judging by the, the amount of space here. Maybe hard, maybe like uh, impossible, or maybe there's just going to be one more here. If there's the card is like this wide, it might be like all the way. Yeah, there's like one more. It's probably hard. And yeah. But for now, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something about the game. And if you did like it, please make sure you leave a thumbs up on the video. And subscribe to my channel for more in the future. As always, thank you so much for your time and attention. I'll see you guys next time.